In this video, I'm going to go through the advanced round robin lead assignment extension that a colleague and I have built. What we wanted to achieve is to make a better round robin assignment system. If you've ever used the round robin system within Zoho CRM, what you'll notice is that it has some shortcomings. The first one is that it doesn't work with leads added via the API, which means that if you have a WordPress site and you're using something like Ninja Forms to add leads into your CRM, your round robin rule won't work. The other thing that we sought to solve is that in some cases, you will want to be able to assign leads not based on a pure round robin, based on if there's three salespeople, they each get 33% of the leads. You might have one star performer who should get more of the leads, maybe 50%. And then you've got some junior salespeople who are learning and who are improving their conversion rate, but to whom you don't want to give too many leads right now, and therefore you only give them 25% each. That's what is possible to do with the advanced round robin lead assignment extension. To install it, you will find it in the marketplace shortly, but for now, if you want to get your hands on it, you'll need the link. You go to your CRM, you install it, and I've got the upgrade view here, but this is what you'll have after you click on install. And you only need to install it for admins, you can choose to either start paying right away or to take a 10 day free trial. And then you'll have it in your CRM. You can see what is installed. It installs two modules, round robin settings and round robin history. Let me explain what they do. Round robin history keeps track of all lead assignments. You might wonder why that is required given that one could just look at the lead module itself to see which salesperson has been assigned to which lead. However, the problem we realized that exists is that if you convert a lead, then you can no longer use that data to determine what percentage of leads the salesperson has. For that reason, we set up this additional module called Route Robin History where it will keep a record of the lead here and the person it was assigned to. That's round robin history. And you probably won't really need to look at that unless you want to do a report and see what percentage of, of uh, leads your salespeople received. What you will probably look at regularly is the round robin settings. This is where you can configure what percentage of leads each salesperson will receive. You'll see that there are several columns. There's the owner, which is the person who will be assigned the leads. And there's the percent, which is the percentage of leads they should receive. Let's add another one so you can see how it works. In the round robin setting name, just put the salesperson's name. In the owner, put the choose the user who should receive the leads. In the percent field, put in the percent that they should receive. Just as a number, you don't need to type percent or anything else. These fields here, email, secondary email, email opt-out, I wish I could hide them. I unfortunately can't do that due to limitations of the Zoho CRM extension system, but you can just ignore them. The ones you need to change are round robin, setting name, owner, and percent. I'm not going to save it because I already have <laughs> the settings adding up to 100% here. It wouldn't make sense to add another one. You can see what it looks like. We've got Hernan getting 20%, test user getting 33% and me getting 47%. That is how you use the round robin extension. 
Again, it will work if you add leads via the API. Let me show you that in action. I have an extension called Postman, which can add leads to the CRM via the API. I've set up a special API endpoint so I can do some testing myself. With Postman, I can also use Postman Collection Runner to add lots of leads in at the time. In this case, I'm going to add 40 leads with a delay of five seconds in between. I'll start the test and you can see what happens. Right now, we have 422 leads in there. And if I refresh again, you will see that there should be more added in. It might just be taking a bit of time to do that. Yeah, just had to boot up the server. So if we refresh now, there should be more. Yes, 425. And you can see that they're being assigned to the different users based on the appropriate percentage. To further confirm that, let's go to the lead assignment report. Here we can see a matrix report with the round robin history and how many they have been assigned. And you can see out of 108, I have received 52.7%, which is what one would expect based on the settings. If we look back here, we'll just verify that it's working as expected. It's a little bit higher. There will be oscillations from time to time, but you can see that it is broadly in that realm. Hernan has got 17%, which is basically what you want, and test user has 31.5%. The reason why they're not exactly as you'd expect is because while I was testing, I was using Postman to add a lot in, and I didn't leave a gap in between. I didn't leave a delay, which meant that it had 50 added all at once, and they then all went to me because at that point there it didn't have time to check back and see what percentage the other salespeople had. But if you are doing it a bit more sensibly where you don't have 50 leads all being added to the CRM at once, then the extension works perfectly to give you round robin lead assignment based on percentages, including for leads that are added via the API. Hope you enjoy the extension and let me know if you see any issues with it or if you want to suggest any changes. The way you can get in touch with me is after you have added the extension, if you go set up and then go to marketplace, you'll be able to see your installed extensions here. And you can simply click on get support and write me a message. Look forward to hearing from you and to you having great results from your round robin lead assignment, being able to ensure that salespeople get the right number of leads.